I'm sick of eating bread for breakfast every day. I gotta get some miso soup. Really? Because I found this great Japanese restaurant. You want to go tonight? No, I want some salty miso soup, the kind that Nana makes. Keep your voice down, please. Ren, you're better off forgetting about women like that. Women like what? Well, since you brought it up, I gotta be honest with you. The truth is, Nana's bad news. She's taking advantage of you. And if she really loved you, then she would care more about the sodium content of the food she cooks. It's salty! <laughs> You're the one who said you wanted miso soup, so just shut up and eat it! Mm. I don't get it. Why do you always have to put so much salt in everything you cook? Misato should have come with us to this weird camp, then she could have been the one to cook all our meals for us. Uh, no. I think that would be asking too much of her. Well, I think she should just go ahead and quit school and become her full-time manager. Great idea! She is responsible. That's a good point. I'd much rather have cute Misato as our manager than that guy we have now. Yasu! <laughs> is there something wrong with me? Everything's, Everything's wrong, wrong with, with you. you. Mm -hmm. What did you say? <clears throat> Kinpei, you're a man, so talk like one. And do you really think we need more than one baldy around here? <sighs> you're one to talk. You're a girl, so why don't you talk like one? And FYI, I'm not bald, I just like shaving my head. Hey, it's not like I'm bald either. I shave my head too. Mmm, <laughs> smells good in here. Oh, hi, Matsuo. Have you had dinner yet? Do you want to join us? No, thanks. Eat it. I eat with the other staff whenever it's your turn to cook, Nana. And that's exactly why your wife decided to leave you once. Oh, a part-time actress to clap and cheer for you. We don't need you to hire actors. Oh, hiring actors is a good idea. It's hard to get Japanese crowds fired up. You shut the hell up. Just think of them as barkers for when a new store opens. It's a way of drawing customers. Hmm. So, you'll sit there and listen to Yasu when he talks? Hold on, you're not sleeping with him, are you? I'm gonna kick your ass! Yippee, try me, girly. Oh God, if Yasu isn't actually clerking at a law firm. What's clerking? I never heard of that before. I guess it's kind of like being a medical intern. After passing the bar exam, you have to work as a law clerk for a year and a half in order to officially become a lawyer. You really know a lot. More like you don't know anything. Oh, and you do? Well, it's not exactly common knowledge. I mean, I only know it because I graduated from law school. <gasps> that is incredible. Now I understand why you wear those glasses. It's really no big deal. And I wear these glasses because they're in fashion. What are you doing babysitting Rara? What do you mean, babysitting? You know, like changing your diapers. I don't wear diapers! All right, that's enough about me. No. Hmm? I want to know all there is to know about you, Mari. Are you free later tonight? How did I get stuck in a band with guys who hit on every girl they see? You're pigs! I wonder if I should ask her. It is okay to ask, isn't it? She said she'd tell me anything, right? I gotta ask, Nana! How did it go with Ren last night? I can't tell you anything about a box of a seat. What? What'd you say? I didn't understand. <laughs> what I said was, I can't tell you anything because I'm in the middle of brushing my teeth. You're not very good at figuring things out, are you, Hachi? Oh, well. What can you expect from a puppy dog? Where the hell did Nana go to get her cigarettes? Another country? Maybe I shouldn't. Why don't I just ask? Hey, Yasu, tell me something. Do you have a girlfriend? I don't seem to be very popular with the ladies. What? But I like you so much! Hey, Yasu. Huh? Ren texted back about Mahjong. He looked at his schedule and he's got days off next month on the 7th and 8th. If we can arrange something for one of those days, he'll come and play. Really? What's this? Can I play too? You know how to play Mahjong, Hachi? Not at all. Then what the hell are you talking about? I want to meet Ren! What's this, Hachiko? I thought you had a thing for Takumi. You big cheater. Don't call me Hachiko! Sheen's getting less and less cute lately. So anyone know where Nana is? She just popped over to Alaska to buy herself some cigarettes. Alaska? <laughs> These are great pics of Rayra. She's so hot. Oh, yeah? So she's your type, Nobu? My type? Well, why not? I can introduce you to this flight attendant who looks like her. You know a flight attendant? That's so cool. Me <laughs> three times in one night. Forget it! I don't want your sloppy seconds. Oh, well, you're lost. Nana, you're back. Where have you been? Huh? <sighs> How old are you? I don't want to see you smoking any more of those cancer sticks. You're such a poser. <sighs> What's gotten into you, Nana? You didn't seem to care about it before. She's so scary. Save me, Hachi. Mm -hmm. Yasu! Okay, enough already. I get the hint. 
No more smoking. No, no smoking? smoking? Why not? We need to increase our lung capacity. Rayola's singing made that big an impact on you, huh? It's nothing to do with her. Screw you, Baldy. Man, you're really good at this. Think you could go easy on me for a while? But I am going easy. Sheen, you're getting more and more obnoxious, you know? And I told you not to smoke. Ren's smoking? But I guess it's okay, because he's your man. <sighs> I never knew you were such a pusher. Listen up, pipsqueak. Underage smoking is against the law, got it? But you started smoking when you were a teenager. What's with this sudden no smoking kick? It's such a drag. No one else seems to want in on it. Yeah, why do you need to quit? I know lots of singers who smoke, and they don't have any problems with their voice. You'd be better off taking singing lessons. Shut your trap. I don't need you telling me what to do. Hey, is that Hachi? It could be. Why don't you go let her in? Listen, guys, it's Nana, not Hachi. <laughs> if you say so. What do I say to him? Nice to meet you. I'm Nana. No, I'm Komatsu. Mm. I've been a big Trap Nest fan forever. Huh? <gasps> Nana, welcome home. Hey, Nana. Okay, so I made her cry. Now what am I supposed to do? At that time, it was a dream come true. The reason I burst into tears was because I knew right away that it was my reward. From you, Nana. I felt your love more than a million thank yous. You made me so happy.